What's up, everyone? Greetings and welcome. This is Don't Call Me Pretentious. I am Paul. I'm playing by myself today, and I'm playing through some Crackdown 3. Uh, if you've been following us on... Oh, I need to delete that. Uh, if you've been following us here, then you know that this is actually a... Uh, the second go at this. I had a bit of a false start where it wasn't recording audio. So I had to start over. Um... But yeah, I'm just playing through Crackdown 3 here on PC, so let's go ahead and watch this cutscene because it's interesting, and this will not be the third time I've watched it, but. New York, Moscow, Seoul. A whole new group of cities just got hit. It's chaos. And the intel we've got is shaky and I like they brought that guy back. These are dark days, Commander. Don't worry, sir. We're here to light shit up. I also love characters. I'll see you here in a minute. Skills! Skills, skills for kills! kills. <laughs> that never gets old. Skills for kills, Agent. Listen up! Our target is New Providence. Now, she may look pretty, but this city is full of corporate. Gangsters, psychopaths, and butchers. We are diving head first into a viper's nest. But I promise you this come tomorrow, we're all gonna be walking around wearing shiny snake skin boots. Thanks. These sons of bitches wanna black out the world? Not on our watch. We are the goddamn agency! And the agency needs justice! By any means necessary! Okay. Someone give me my jail! <laughs> this is it, agents! Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. It's a really good sound to like for that. <laughs> Cause that's not what the song is, but I really thought it was what it was. Stand tall, agent. Ain't nothing gonna take us down. We are the strongest, baddest ass kickers on earth. Quack, quack, motherfucker! Oh shit. Jesus. Commander, that did not agents, go as planned. Do you hear me? Report in. That's an order. You're still with me, Agent. The rest of your team. They didn't make it. Wait, how is he the only one that survived? We saw him explode. The assholes that did this to you? We can make them hurt. Pay them back for what they did. But first, I need to know. We saw him explode, though. What, can what I is trust going on? You? Oh, yeah. Give it the Terminator 2. Thumbs up. I'll take that as a yes. Yeah, see, he explodes. That he's got still caught alive. In a crash, but I recovered some agency intel. Combined I can believe that own. a Terry Crews. Terry Crews is what you need The blackout attacks. Hundreds of cities got hit. Power grids, communications, it all went down. Things got real bad real quick. People were desperate. They left their homes, their lives. Millions of refugees, all looking for a little light in the darkness. And I was one of them. Anakshi. Anakshi Swift. But most people call me Echo. We spent weeks on the water. Low on food, hope. But then... Terranova rescued us and brought us here. To New Providence. 
an island nation founded by Elizabeth Neiman, Terra Nova's CEO. At first, nice. I thought this place was paradise. You gotta love a corporate, but the deeper uh, corporate I state. At Neiman and the rest of her team, they're not what they seem. Of course they're not. And I bet you thought the same right before your team got shot out of the sky. Now, it's just you, me, and a city filled with survivors from the blackout zones. We can help them rise up, Agent. That's right. Rise up and knock Terra Nova down. Down with the capitalist pigs, right? No, no. But seriously, though, I bet a corporate state, that, that sounds fun. It's good times. Good times. So, to be fair, I've actually already played through this a little bit last night. Um, just a couple of missions. Okay. Just to get familiar with it and today. make sure the performance the was good process. and everything like that. And it wasn't going to be bogging frame rate and stuff while I'm playing. So. And also, forgive me, my, my voice, if I sound nasally, I... Uh, Still getting over a cold that I had earlier this week. That's why we didn't record. That's why we didn't record any episodes this week. Um, just lots of other stuff going on between Valentine's Day and... Oh, hey, look at that. Uh, between Valentine's Day and then I was sick and then... Uh, yeah, so we, we just didn't get around to it, unfortunately. But uh, but we'll, we'll be back. So until then, I'm just playing through some Crackdown 3. And I'm playing on PC. As it says in the description, if you're watching this live on Twitch. If you're watching this later on YouTube. Some kind of agency training hologram. Stream live on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash don't call me pretentious. Go, uh, go follow us. We're trying to, trying to increase our follower base there. I'm going to try to stream more regularly, but we'll see how it goes. Another Terra Nova rescue operation. They've been airlifting refugees for weeks. Welcome, citizens of the world. Welcome to New Problem. Terra Nova was born from a dream. A vision of brighter tomorrows. A vision powered by human potential. Together, we okay. will forge a bold... We need to shut down the propaganda they're feeding the refugees. And the right. force fields they use to contain them in the outlands. Best way to do that? Take out the nearby power station. I think I need to increase my mouse sensitivity here. Yeah, it's taking. Hold on, let me go. Let me go do this. I did this last night, but I started a new thing, and oh no, it's still still there. One hundred twenty percent. Maybe I'll give myself a little more. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Yeah. All right. I like uh, I like a pretty sensitive mouse, but I didn't want to turn my DPI up too much because it makes other things get weird. Neiman's propaganda towers are like perverted versions of the Statue of Liberty. Give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses, and I'll subject them to my unique brand of trademarked oppression. It makes me sick. Oh, there we go. I don't know. They sound like they uh, professional victims. There's a joke. There's a lefty joke. If you don't know, we're pretty uh, we're pretty leftist here on Don't Call Me Pretentious, and uh, we have a political channel over on uh, YouTube, YouTube.com. Don't Call Me Political. We also have a podcast, but we haven't really done anything with it recently. Agent, um, you shut down the we'd like to get back to it, but we just haven't. The city gates. Even better, they'll cut off Neiman's propaganda. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, so we're going to the power station. Let's go. This game immediately, though, it gets its hooks just like the original Crackdown. This is the place, Agent. Watch out for the guards. Just like the original Crackdown, like I just want to go around getting, uh, I just want to go around getting orbs, like ability, agility orbs, and stuff like that. There we go. Uh, it looks like your suit just updated. I'm seeing new jump boosters unlocked and active. New jump boosters. Welcome, citizens of the world. Oh. Welcome to New Terra Nova was born from a dream. 
Oop. Just evolved. Ooh, our eyes just evolved. Your aim. Dead eye. Oh yeah. This sub target accuracy. system. I like it. It's a good way to get headshots. But it takes a little bit too much, I feel like to get uh, with the mouse. You have to move the mouse too much. Those guards didn't get a chance to call in. Still off the radar. Oh. So I watch what I mean, like I have to like do a huge deliberate move to get that to happen, which is a little weird. Uh, I, you can adjust that in the settings though, but then it gets too easy to just like lose sockets. aim completely. Of course, some people will be like, oh, why do you have auto aim anyway on PC? Just use the mouse controls. But you can see like they're really, there's not acceleration to it, which is weird. So it feels like even if I move the mouse, like really far or faster the camera doesn't really move faster which feels a little weird oh okay here we go here's our first here's our first gang lord berg is our first target if all goes well he won't be our last. His official title is Manpower Lieutenant. A fancy term for bastard who preys on the helpless. And he gets away with it because he's got the keys to the city. I marked your crime map with that power station you took down. But Berg has already tapped into a set of backup generators. His main gateway is still locked down. If we're going okay. to get you and the refugees into the city, we've got to take that backup station out. Yep. Let's go do it. Now I that Terra Nova there. knows you're here, They'll be increasing their defenses. Stay alert. Explosive skill increased. Okay. Look at that. And just like that. Oh. Now you can store more gadgets and explosive ammo. That's nice. Oh, hey, look at that. Oh. Because I claimed it. So now I have a hologram on top of the building. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, what is... Oh, that's, uh, what's her name? It's the CEO of Terra Nova, right? Interesting. Okay. Oh, there's another agility orb. Let's go get that. I just want to go around getting agility orbs. Stop shooting at me. Stop shooting at me. It will recharge over time. But if you attack an enemy... Looks like your shield will recharge even faster. I guess the agency likes to reward aggressive action. Here we go. Pick it up. Pick it up. Yeah, there we go. Too many Nova thugs use those guns on the people. Let's see how they like being in your sights. All right. Okay, that's all cool and everything, but I'm going to get this agility orb. Because everybody knows Crackdown is more fun once you have really leveled up agility and you're just running around jumping like 40 feet in the air oh my goodness almost fell. by the way you can't fall in this water look at it it's green you take you take damage so, Watch out. That that's chimera an interesting will melt right through your suit chimera it's a weird name for it all right here we go coming up on an old nova supply point get close and i'll see if i can reactivate it for you all right Right. Supply point is yours. Check it out. Uh, here we go. Looks like any weapons and equipment you find are automatically added to your inventory. You can access your inventory from supply points. Okay. Oh, so anything I anything I add is added to the inventory. Okay. I can also fast travel. Agent. Oh, I can select my agent. I I'm stick. I'm sticking with Terry Crews. I like Terry Crews. I'm a big fan. All right. You found a fragmentation grenade? Looks like pretty standard explosive fare. Eh. 
seen like it's so hard to get maybe it's because they're far away that's why it's harder to get a dead eye aim on his head because I, like, I moved the mouse a lot and it didn't didn't change to sub target his head which is interesting it's made, like i said maybe distance has an impact on it Oh, oh. I thought I could go into it, but that's a reflection. Wait, what is that reflecting? Is that a reflection, or is that supposed to be like the inside of the building? That's weird. Okay. We need to take out the other power points if we want to drop the gateway force field. Yeah, I know. I'm on it. into Berg's gateway systems and he's vulnerable now we know where he is all that's left is taking him out and by the way apologies if you can hear fan noise in the background that's my gaming computer it's a uh, it's a little loud because it's a uh, it's a mini ITX build and there's a lot of hardware in it and I have a blower style GPU in there and they're not known for being all that quiet seems your grip on the world is getting stronger you can grab objects from longer range now. Not to mention my streaming PC is probably making a good amount of noise too, so... All together... You probably hear some fan noise in the background, that's what I'm saying. Oh, look at that! Boom, son! Robot wardens. These machines are relentless. No pity, no remorse. No fear. Reinforcements. As long as he lives, they'll keep coming for you. See again, really difficult to get a to get a headshot aim there. So here's a question: Why does shooting a robot in the head do more damage than shooting it anywhere else? Right, like. Seems like that really shouldn't be a thing. Cause you figure it's, I don't know. Maybe they put the CPU in the head, but it seems like if I was building robot soldiers, I wouldn't put the CPU in the head. I put it in the torso cause you can put more armor there. Of course then why would you make it uh, humanoid, right? So it may not be the most efficient design combat but maybe it is I don't know it's definitely very efficient for traversal so anyway I'm rambling now okay yeah I don't need anything from this. let's go the gate is closed the city belongs to Delano the gate stays closed to agency assholes. How'd he do that? Well, just teleported. 
Oh, he's got a teleporter. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. There we go. Okay, where are you? Hurting him. Keep it up. Where'd he go? There he is. Fuck you. You won't take me down. Keep focused. Hit him hard. Watch where he goes. Have you lost something, Agent? Come on. Oh wait, I'm out of ammo. There's it, there he is. Okay, enough! Let's finish this! You will never breach my defenses! Protect me! Come on, come on, come on, come on, die. Oh shit. Ah, oh, gotcha. Holy huh. shit. Death rattle. It. We got past the gatekeeper. That's right. And the people of the Outlands. We've helped them into the city. Microsoft Studios presents. I know we just met, Agent. But I've got to say, we make a damn good team. And we're just getting started. Yeah, we do, Echo. Hey, Tim. I'm glad they got him back. Oh, it's your boss, man. This is Agency Director Charles Goodwood. Who the hell am I talking to? You can call me Echo. Or even better, the person who put your agent back together after some shitty intel almost got them killed. Thank you very much. Stealing agency data is a criminal offense, Miss Swift. Hey, the only criminals I see are wearing Terra Nova suits. And with my help, your agent is already bringing them to justice. Listen up, civilian. The agency is the world's preeminent civilian task force. We've been kicking ass since before you were born. This time, it's I'm so condescending about it. When the blackouts hit, even we were blindsided. Then our satellites came back online and found the one major city still glowing in the dark. Five years ago, this place was a desolate spit of land in the ocean. Yes, it's truly inspiring what a greedy, all-powerful corporation can accomplish. It all starts with Elizabeth Neiman, but she's recruited one hell of a team to build her dream. Dick Catala Vargas, head of the industry division. I mean, Vargas so it's Elysium, right? Like, that's what this is. This is Elysium. In charge of Chimera, the stuff that blacked out the world and left so many of us lost in the darkness. Or how about Kulinagata? The hired muscle handling security. He is a butcher who will do anything to protect company interests, especially if it means spilling other people's blood. Last but not least, Yikes. Alois Quist, architect of Terra Nova Logistics, Yeesh. the control freak who designed this entire island and keeps it running like clockwork at any cost. So, what you're saying is the trains run on time? Maybe. Terra Nova is using local monorail stations to direct dark. the flow of human resources. If the refugees end up on those monorail trains, God only knows what will happen to them. Agent, you are in enemy territory with no shortage of viable targets and a clear-cut mission directive. Save the people, save the world. Take down Terra Nova by any means necessary. All right. We're going to get now this, that I'm uh... Back into your vitals, I see our friend regen you with a baseline set of skills. 
You'll need to rebuild yourself if we're going to save the world. Wouldn't all this be easier with a bit more agency assistance? Yeah. Maybe we'll get lucky and find more survivors, but all other assets are overwhelmed in the blackout zones. So for the time being, you're on your own. Unless we start a revolution. If the locals want to help, great. But my agent is there for one reason. To stop the blackout attacks. I don't know, man. You sound like you sound just like the man. I'm with Echo. Start a revolution. Oh, I want that. I want that. I'm going for that. See, this is what happens when I played the first crackdown. Like all the time. It's like you just get distracted. Like, oh, I just get distracted going for orbs. I never even finished the first crackdown because of that. Yes, you will be mine. Yes. Got it. I never even finished the first crackdown. I played it multiple times. I played it, you know, it's on Xbox One backwards compatible. I really recommend that you play it if you never played it. I think it's free right now. If I'm not mistaken. Or or cheap at least. So if you haven't played it, I recommend it. It's fun. But I never finished it because I, I got pretty far. I just always got so caught up going for orbs. There's just so much to do. So much fun to have. Look, look at them. Look at them. They're beckoning. They're calling me. I must go get them. Wait, I hear another one. You hear it? I hear it. Where is it? Wait, where is it? I hear it, but I can't see it. You're taking damage. Ah, there it is. Got it. I will say one thing I miss about the original crackdown is when you fell from long distances it like broke the ground the key to taking out a vehicle lockup destroying their vehicles drop any defenses and leave their rides a smoking wreck ooh I kind of don't like this gun. It does a lot of damage, but man, it's... The force field around the vehicles is powered by something around here. Trace the cables. Find the power source. You know the deal, Agent. Drop the force field and oh. blow the enforcer vehicle sky high. There we go. Hey, hey guys, you want to help? I mean, I could use some help. That would be fun, but that's okay. You guys keep chilling. Wait. Teach those enforcers a lesson in justice. I'm seeing enforcer squads with grenade launchers. Get ready. The enforcers roll out oppression from these vehicle yeah. lockups. Take no, out no, the no. transport get the, get the grenade and begin launcher. to mobilize them. There we go. Whoa! Snikes. Demolition. It's a hell of a drug. Come on. Come on. There we go. Force field down. Hit the vehicle.
Wait, where? Hit what vehicles? What vehicles am I hitting? Oh. Oh. Okay. I have one simple request. Kill the agent. Do your fucking job. Meet Lieutenant Liv Sorensen, protector of the people, head enforcer of Terra Nova rules. According to agency intel, Lip Sorensen is a professional peacekeeper for dictators, rogue states, Ooh. and now corrupt corporate enterprises. Sorensen's enforcers are posted across the city. When trouble sparks, word spreads fast to nearby units, putting them on alert, but also in our sights. The more of her enforcer brigade you wipe out, the faster Sorensen will be isolated, and then we can deliver some justice. Yep. This is the old, the old uh, crackdown. Now that they know where you are, Agent, Gameplay they'll be loop. scrambling more hit squads to hunt you down. So watch your back and take them out first. You know, it's funny. I saw this game got a lot of bad reviews, but I mean, like, so far, it feels a lot like. Uh, you know the deal. Shotguns cut through trouble. It's a lot like Crackdown One. I don't know. Which I liked Crackdown one, so I don't know, I'm not sure yet why I got such bad reviews. Performance seems to be okay. I mean obviously I'm playing on PC, so that varies from PC to PC, but you know, I watched the digital foundry and it looks like it runs fine on Xbox. I'm not sure why I got bad reviews. There's a monorail station near here. Uh, what is this? Monkey moonshine. What is this? It's worse than booze. It's toxic swill. And the locals are hooked on it. Okay. You should blow up every tank and kiosk you find. Oh, okay. I'm blowing these up. All right. So much for that toxic batch. I was gonna don't see many refugees at that monorail station, but we should still shut it down just in case. See if you can draw out the AI station master. Yeah. Wait, what? Then put the robotic bastard down. Robot loaders. They'll Ooh. hit you with anything they can throw. Oh, that hurt. Please be aware. A hostile agent has been spotted in the vicinity. Station defenses are activated. Thank you. That's right. Screw off. Be advised. Has been detected in your area. Activating Wait. basic station defense protocol. Thank you. Damn. Uh. was activating the prisoner hard points. The locking of militia members. We need them back on the street, ready to mobilize. Have a nice day. Whoa. Focus on the station marker. Oh no. Ah, gotcha. Hey, there we go. I wondered when Roxy would come out to play. Oh, look at it. So, it looks so happy. Oh, well, not anymore. Yeesh. The monorail network on New Providence is run by Roxy, a friendly customer service AI, corrupted by Terra Nova. Oh, wait. <laughs> Every monorail station we take forces Roxy. One to of the lieutenants is an AI. AI. Putting more of their network. All right, I guess. So the more That's a little. You capture, yeah. The closer we get to finding Whatever. and That's fine. We're having fun. Roxy. We're having fun. I will say this for him. For a bunch of fascists, they have a pretty diverse group hey, of uh good news. While pretty you diverse that group of, uh, station, of enforcers. The they reached the refugees before Terra Nova. Good. Then we can oh, focus no, on dismantling grenades. the rest of the enemy's distribution network. But be ready, agent. 
They won't make it easy. Yeah, no. Okay. Hey, ammo. Here we go. Good ammo. Yeah, there we go. All right. Hey, should I blow those up too? Well, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna take your car. Nice ride. And I'm sure the owner doesn't mind the agency borrowing it. I've scanned yeah, your inventory, so it's available anytime you need it. Just hit a vehicle capture pad around the city. Okay. Wait, a vehicle capture pad? I see you're near one of Nova's chemical sites. Part of the toxic industrial network. It needs to go. No bones about it. Whoa, hey. Why are you harassing these people? I want that. No, I'm getting distracted. I'm like that dog and up. Everyone There's knows squirrel. agility orbs boost your speed and jumps, but the hidden orbs boost all your skills. They may be harder to earn, oh. but if you want to be an all-purpose killing machine, they're a good way to get there. Can I get up here? Yeah. Oh, he climbs the wall. He does a little wall climb. Oh, that's nice. See, I really want that agility upgrade. Come on, here we go. Yeah, there we go. Wait, is there another one? Another one there. Ah. Uh. Whoa, Jesus. Up, agent. Boom, look at that. Climb Terra Nova's corporate ladder to cut him off at the head. There we go. Keep in mind, you've been bioengineered to jump higher, move faster, and conquer any obstacle with ease. You just need to keep upping your agility. Incendiary charges give new meaning to the term scorched earth. Okay. Incendiary charge. Wait. I kind of what, what, what's in, what's in here? Lockdown, secure storage. I kind of want to get in there. Agent, enforcer oh, units so are sorry. active in this area. I'm so sorry. Their heavy armor may deter local resistance, but they weren't built <clears throat> to handle an agent's skills. Oh. Heads up out there! I'm seeing Punisher drones nearby. If I'm honest. Why are you doing this? You're free. Watch the enemy fire. You've got the wrong person. That's right. Good job, Agent. Militia won't forget how you helped them out here. Victory for freedom. Although I'm beginning to wonder if some of the backlash to the game was like people complaining about it. Freeze targets caught in their blast radius, and frozen targets make easy targets. Uh, some of it's politics because it feels like it's trying to be super woke. <laughs> The SJWs are at it again. Grease them, agent. Oh. Whoa, hey. Every supply point you take gives us a firmer foothold. What, 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 what is that? This machine oh, pistol go. is all about filling the air with lead at close range. Oh, another supply point. Okay, cool. Agent DNA. Is there anything? Oh, that just lets me change the agent again. Alright. Oh, let's go. Okay. So, so where, where should we go next? Uh, is 
survival chance 58 percent intel fragment oh, what are intel fragments let's go see what that is wait where did it go oh there we go you collect the better equipped you'll be to take down Terra Nova so see him get him and kick ass agent that's right oh here we go this, this is where I want. oh no I need to keep going higher okay okay Intel. Where am I supposed to go for Intel? Oh, is this it? Nice. You found a link to Nova's oh, internal okay, here we go. What is this? Secret recordings of Neiman's leadership team. It's an old Intel fragment, but may hold something good. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. We have run a sweep and gathered specimens that fit your requirements. Some directly from the workforce. Others pulled to silence dissonance. Excellent. Work with Quist to ensure they are assigned to the proper research project. And that delivery and processing is timely. Of course. The proper channels are being maintained and respected. Ah, yes. Respect. Such a fragile thing. But soon enough, the world will show us. We'll show Terra Nova the measure of respect we deserve. Oof, I dark. await the day, ma'am. Our future is bright. Dark. I don't like it. I don't like them. They don't seem nice. Oh, okay. There you go. It broke the ground. All right. Well, that's good. That's a thing. Oh, there we go. Another orb going after it. Terra Nova manages so many. to keep a lot of good people placated with a message of hope, shitty jobs, and mind-numbing chemicals. Most have settled into this life because well, they oh, don't see a way left. out. Not to get all sappy and shit, but you're the way out, Agent. Aww. That's right. Let's start this revolution. Oh, no. Why didn't you... Oh, I need to be able to jump higher to get it, don't I? It's a shame. Or fall. No, it's that is weird. Why can't I climb up? Vehicle lockup. Scrap it. Where? Is it above me? What, what are you talking about? Vehicle lockup. Oh. More force fields. Nova uses these electric barriers to secure supplies, weapons, innocent people. You know, valuable company assets. Hmm. I think we call those human resources. Oh wow, it's frozen. That's interesting. I'm just gonna assume that was necessary. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, it was necessary. Got killed. All right, I guess we got to go up. Hot lead. 
good for justice, bad for your health. Yeesh, dark. Where, where, where's the force field? Field agent, look for the power source. Oh, ah, there we go. All right, let's go get it now. Field, expose their vehicles. And then I want to go get that uh, agility. Got it. Operation Bayback is in full swing. This is about control. Control! And we are losing it. The agency threat is only part of the problem, sir. The locals rising up. That is a powder keg set to go. Only yeah, question is. is, who lights the fuse and who gets blown to kingdom fucking come? If I get my wish, every one of those oppressive assholes will get blown to smithereens. Only Eesh. one way to make it happen. Keep hitting those enforcer targets, Agent. Show Terra Nova the meaning of real justice. Oh man, now I forgot. Where, where was that uh, agility point? Or agility uh, orb. That's what, that's what I wanted. That's where I was going. I forgot about it. Excuse me, Emma. Spread the sickness, oh. Agent. There's no damage like toxic damage. Yeesh. I mean, this is kind of bringing out the, uh, the Star Trek in me. It's like, well, that stuff burns. If if we're gonna if we're gonna be attacking these oppressive corporate fascists, as apparently we are, like, okay, if we're using chemical weapons to do it, eh, it feels a little dirty. It's like it's like, do we really deserve to win if that's how we're gonna fight? You know. It's the classic Star Trek quandary. Which, if you watch our reviews over on YouTube.com, don't call pretentious, you'll see that's kind of some of the problems I have with it right now is uh, with the Section 31. I mean, that was always a problem with Section 31, which is why it was always kind of weird. And now they're making it such a big part of the show. It's, it's, it's a little disappointing from that perspective. Uh, can, I, can I grab that? No. I may not may not be able to jump high enough yet here. Agent, Let's... I'm working to track and force a presence across the island. I found hot spots where you can maximize damage. Go do there it. There we go. Got it. Oh, oh, I want that one. I don't think I can get that high yet though. Got it. Got that one, but I don't think I can get that one yet. Yeah. No, can't get there yet. That's all right. We'll get to it eventually. Let's go get this one. Oh. As you know, the more you prove your skills, the more dormant cells inside you activate. Power. It's a beautiful thing. Yeah, it is. I don't know, though. Man, you creep me out when you say stuff like that. 
I liked it better when you were just saying skills for kills. Ooh. Come on, Jackson. They're still functioning. It's like the Boston River on St. Patrick's Day. Give those harvesters something to chew on. Wait, what? Who are these people? Take a lot. Whatever you can find, the bigger the better. Oh, that's gonna take a lot. And I'm dying. Lock up those harvesters. Jam them good. shield okay sick move agent sick sick moves distance. Jeez, it's, it's just, it's not doing much damage. These harvesters can only choose so much. Choke them up. Oh. Feeling it was regenerating. You're almost out of explosives, Agent. Did that do anything? Because otherwise, I'm running out of ammo. Yeah, that's not really doing anything. Okay, let's get, let's get more ammo. I feel like I'm missing something. Is there an easier way to take this out? 
is not doing much damage. Yeah, that's, that's just not doing much. Oh, shit. Nope, that's not what I want. That bullet has their name on it. Yeah, well, okay, so... I thought these boulders in here? Is that, is, that, is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Oh, wait, is that doing it? That might be doing it. Yeah, okay, there we go. Ready for later. <clears throat> well done. You're now authorized to use agency limpet grenades. Collect them from your nearest supply point and stick it to Terra Nova. All right, one more. Oh no, that one was enough. Yeah, there we go. The field's valve is good to go. Take yeah. it out. Wait. Oh, I'm gonna go up here. Wait. How do I get up there? Oh. Ah, here we go. Yeah. This one's easy to destroy. There we go. Got it. The agency has come to destroy us. Welcome them with chemical death. Say hello to Nova's chemical chief, an arrogant blowhard named Jaiman Keita. as a genius just ask him an expert in chemical refinement and manipulation he's also the ultimate gross polluter poisoning the world to feed nova's top secret chimera experiments the infrastructure gate has set up is intricate so each chem site you destroy should put more strain on others nearby the more sites you shut down the closer we get to flushing out jaiman keita and ending the chemical threat okay What is this? Yeah, that's that's where I'm going. I'm gonna go free some prisoners. I'm tapping into the chem network's monitoring system, and pressure is already surging from the pipelines. Yeah, the next fire facility still you increase. hit should be ripe to pop. It'll also be better defended. Brace for more fun. Terry Crews. Fuck you, ground. Indeed. The more you damage Terra Nova's chemical infrastructure, the less Chimera they can process. The less they process, the more pressure on their chain of command. Meaning, you weaken their operations, you start eliminating players from the board. 
This fancy piece of Zorchem engineering turns an industrial melting tool into a flesh burning powerhouse. Ooh. All right, let's go try it out. Let's go free some prisoners and try out our new gun. Ooh. Oh. That's dark. Oh. Enemy down. Excellent. Wait, where? Where are you? Oh. Dark. We'll regroup with the militia and be ready when we need them. Oh, okay. I'm part of the hashtag resistance. I like it. Uh, where was the other one? Wait, what is this? What, what, what is that? Agent DNA. Yeah, okay. Oh no! Agility orbs can be tricky to reach. That's the point. Up your game. There we go. Not that one. But I'm trying to get to this DNA thing. What is that? Oh, DNA, okay. I'll be damned. You found one of our lost agents. Oh. At least the remains. Luckily, with their DNA, we can regenerate them. Oh, okay. This is a new character I can play. That's interesting. But why would I play anybody other than Terry Crews? And yes, I know they have different abilities and all that stuff. It was rhetorical. In reality, Terry Crews is awesome, and I'm just going to keep playing as him. Oh, there it was. The forces have been snatching up locals in an effort to squash the militia's uprising. We need to give the resistance some breathing room, and our best option is to hit a nearby strategic enforcement location. Ooh, I want that. I don't think I can get up there yet, but I want it. that one. I'm gonna go try. Okay. Oh, no. Can, can I make it? Can I make it? Nope. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, hey, that water is not polluted. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, see, Terra Nova's not so bad. They leave a little bit of unpolluted water. Well, what more do you want from them, honestly? I think the real problem is people are just too uh, discriminatory against people of wealth. That's what it feels like to me. Hear that, Agent? There's a hidden orb somewhere around here. Yeah. I hear it. Oh, 
Oh, okay. That's it. I was hoping it was one of those uh, multi, <laughs> multi orbs. Oh, what is this? Oh, survival chance, 39%. That's okay, we're going back there. We're gonna free some prisoners. See, I can't stop myself from going to get orbs. If they're in my line of sight, I gotta go get them. This is why I never finished Crackdown 1. Hit him with the sickness. I don't know, man. Sounds like you enjoy this too much. Go, you're free. Hard point shut down, and the militia members are free. Quack quack, motherfucker. Join the hashtag resistance. Oh. No burn like a chemical burn. Okay, you're you're enjoying it too much. It's creeping everybody out, man. Just just take it down. You're at an eleven. We need you to be at like a five. All right, another intel fragment. I wonder how many more of these old recordings there are. Performance rating stands at 99.97%. All systems, drivers, and networks, all functions, optimal. I can map operations across 1,138 varied parameters to ensure seamless integration with cross-platform needs. Roxy, Roxy, my sweet, sweet thing. I asked how you were feeling. Remember, Wait, is that the ER? I'm AI? asking for more than a systems update. Do you understand? Feeling. Now, an emotional state for reaction. I understand. And how do you feel? Optimal. <laughs> ah, that's a start. He's trying to make the AI feel emotions. Alright. You know what? What if... She starts to feel emotions and she starts to feel empathy and she joins our side. Dude, I hope that's what happens. That's what I want to happen. Make it like Sunny and iRobot. Fuck you, Gravity. Terry Crews, what a boss. Logistics clipper flying in. Oh. Knocking out Terranova's infrastructure will take the shackles off neighborhoods like this. So here's what I'll say about this so far. It feels a lot like Crackdown. And it has that same... Uh, that same addictive loop 
right? I keep, I just want to keep playing. And so when I started this, I thought, you know what? I'll do like a nice 30 minute, you know, jaunt and just, to just to get first impressions, right? Boost your skills across and then the I started board. playing and I was like, well, Unleash maybe I'll do an hour. Bit of goodness we put into you. About an hour is, is what we try to do for our, for our videos, you know, because y- you start to lose interest after a while. I mean, depending on the video, we do even shorter. We'll do half an hour. But, but especially if you're doing gameplay, after an hour, it, it just gets to be too much unless, you know, there's something really, you know, important happening. And here I am. We're at about an hour and 10 minutes and I just want to keep playing. <laughs> so I'm going to keep playing. But if you're asking, if you're looking for my first impressions, you know, that should tell you that that's, that's kind of where I am right now is, uh, I like it. It, it feels, fun freezing targets in place. it feels a lot like, uh, like crackdown and I like Terry Crews. I also like, uh, it feels like it's got a super woke <laughs> plotline with, uh, you know, this corporate city going on and everybody talking about oppression and stuff like that. At the same time, it's the same thing that always happens with like Handmaid's Tale, for example, where it's weird, where it's like, you know, okay, like these people are supposed to be fascists and they are and all that, but like they're super diverse fascists and it's like, yeah, that's not, fascists don't tend to be all that diverse. <laughs> You know, so it feels a little bit weird. And, and like I said, you know, I have the same Skills critique of Handmaid's kills, Tale, Agent. which However is where it's like threat, in the in book, it was very much like kills. there was a lot of racism, too. And in the show, they don't really go over that that a whole lot. They just kind of ignore it. In fact, there's not a lot of racism there. And it, it's kind of weird. Hey, look at this. Wait, what is this? What are we doing? Are we just having a rave? Wait, how, how do I dance? How do I dance? I want to dance. Agent, I just clocked a spike at nearby Enforcer Communications. They're on high alert. Good news is, we've got their attention on us and not the civilians. Better news? Okay, we've that's got enough you, of that. And they don't stand a chance. I wish I could dance. That's the, okay. First critique. First critique. Let me dance. Fortnite figured that out. Fortnite knew what was up, and uh, and I could deal with some of that here in Crackdown Three. And you know, here's the other thing I'll say about Crackdown Three. Look, if you have Xbox Game Pass, then you get like I do. Like you just you're getting it no matter what. Play it. Right? Just just give it a try. It, it's because I'm having fun right now. And it didn't cost me any. Well, I mean, obviously I pay for Xbox Game Pass. But, you know, like it didn't cost me anything extra <laughs> in addition to Xbox Game Pass. And that's, uh, and that's cool. Fun. And I'm playing on PC. And, and that was something I wasn't sure, actually, if you could play Xbox Game Pass games on PC, but you can. I just went to the uh, Windows Store and clicked on Crackdown, and I was like, oh, install now. And I was like, all right, yeah, I'll install it. And here we are, and I'm playing on my PC. And if you're wondering about specs, so if you can try to gauge performance, uh, my PC specs, I have an i7 4790K and a GTX 1080. And they're both at stock because they're both in the uh, a pretty small micro ITX build. That's why it's a little loud and you can hear the fan. Um, it has 16 gigs of RAM, I think. Yeah, maybe 32. I, I'm pretty sure it's 16. This isn't my main computer. I built this back in 2014 originally. And uh, anyway, so everything's at stock. Uh, in terms of settings in the game, everything's at ultra. I have it running at 4K, even though the stream is in this recording is just in 1080p. Uh, the game is rendering at 4K, but I have the resolution scale set to 1440p. So the game is technically running at 1440p, but one thing I like about it is you have a lot of options, and 
uh, so you can set resolution scale. And so by default, like the HUD and the menus and everything are at 4K, which is native resolution of the monitor I'm playing on. But you can actually render the game at any... They have set resolution scales. So you can find any resolution scale. And it has dynamic resolution and to keep 60 FPS. And right now, I mean, I'm holding... 60 FPS fairly, fairly easily. Again, everything maxed out at 1440p on a GTX 1080. I have an RTX 2080 Ti on the way, um, but I, you know, it's it's not here yet, so so I can't play with that. And I I will say I feel like there might be a bit of a CPU bottleneck uh, with my 4790K. So if you have an older processor, keep that in mind. But uh, I do think that I saw yesterday when I was doing some performance testing, uh, it looked like it was getting some, some CPU bottlenecking. Nice cold. And again, you know, I, the 4790K is at... The 4790K is at uh, stock settings, so if you have yours overclocked, you might be okay. Um, I don't, because again, it's in a contained. Remember that. Enforcement officer. Small four-factor chassis, and uh, it just doesn't have that much cooling potential. So I can't, I can't overclock. Whoa! Hello. Karanova's officially marked you as a threat agent. That's what happens when you attack their assets. The more damage you cause, the tougher units they'll deploy to take you out. We'll track the current threat level on your HUD. If you're getting overwhelmed, head to a supply point to get you off their radar. Enforcer target down. Oh, it's getting real. Another wave of security boots headed right for you. Oh man. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, I died. Wow, that got intense. Okay, well. Let's go ahead and do this. Alright. Well, so that's my first impressions, first playthrough of Crackdown 3. And like I said, if you have Xbox Game Pass, might as well play it. I mean, it's not going to cost you anything extra, right? You're already paying for Game Pass, so just go ahead and play it. I like it. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of wondering. I haven't read any of the reviews. I'm kind of wondering why it got such bad reviews. Um, because it doesn't seem like... Uh, I don't know. It feels it feels like Crackdown to me. And I liked Crackdown. So if you liked Crackdown, you probably will like this game. So I would check it out. So as always, this has been Paul. Don't call me pretentious. You can watch this video live. Or you could have watched this video live. Or maybe you're watching this video live now on twitch.tv slash don't call me pretentious. Uh, this will go up on YouTube later on youtube.com don't call me pretentious. Make sure to uh, follow us on Twitch. We're trying to increase our follower count there. Uh, we traditionally stream our podcast every uh, every Wednesday night at around 8 p.m. Uh, we didn't do it this week because um, there were issues and and um, I was sick and and then we missed our stuff. We also uh, do Star Trek Discovery reviews um, every Thursday night Brad after the episode airs over on YouTube. We stream it live. Uh, again, we didn't do it this week because uh, I was still sick, and also it was Valentine's Day, so there were commitments. Um, but normally that's what we do. So so go ahead and give us a follow, give us a like, give us a subscribe, and comment. What do you think of Crackdown 3? Did you like Crackdown 1? Have you played Crackdown 3? What do you think it so far? And uh, if you're seeing, if you're playing on PC, go ahead and comment with uh, what kind of performance you're getting out of your system and what your specs are. And uh, with that, we'll, uh, we'll end this episode. Thank you for watching. Bye.